What caused the Civil War? Boy, I tell you, that's a topic that we've argued about ever since the time of the war itself. The single word answer has to be slavery. But ever since the time of the war itself, we've war argued over just how it was slavery. Lincoln says it was somehow the cause of the war. And it's that somehow that's been at the heart of this mystery. I think the somehow is that you have to pull the camera back and see how slavery is entangled in the fundamental structures of government, of economy, and of communication. Slavery has been around for a long time. Why does it become a problem? an insurmountable problem when it does. It becomes an insurmountable problem when it does when the American population is so politically mobilized, virtually every white man is voting, and slavery becomes an object of contention. It becomes an issue that cannot be avoided when the telegraph and daily newspapers spread across the entire nation, so you're reading about slavery every day, and things that are said in Congress are carried all over the country. You can't just get away with playing off one side, depending where you live. And it becomes a part of the very fabric of the American economy. Eighty percent of all American exports are produced by slavery. The North feels it's got to find some way to contain the spread of slavery, or it's going to consume the entire nation. So those problems churn away through decades, and finally a new party, the Republican Party, emerges to articulate the interests of the white North, and when that happens, the conflict really cannot be avoided any longer. Nobody believes it's going to lead to the civil war that actually occurs, with the equivalent of six million people today being killed, but people do believe now the time has come to confront these issues for once and for all.